Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. If you guys are new here, hello, my name is Dion, a photographer here in New York City. If you haven't done so already, please feel free to check out my work on my Twitter, on my IG. Um, it's linked below for your convenience. Okay, so for today's video, we're doing our sequel to our first um, video we did on the boys' comeback album, mini album called Be Awake. Um, I'm not sure how many photo sets were released during uh, this comeback. Um, if there's more, let me know and I'll check those out. But I pulled up two and this is the second one that came up. Um, I'm excited to see uh, these images because the last time I just really loved them. They look really good. The photographer, the team, everything everything they did was so great. So I'm sure this will be great as well. Um, now, I am going to do a bunch of <laughs> photo shoot reviews of 17's most recent comeback they're coming out with. Um, I believe they release two maybe three photo sets already i know for sure two i'm not sure if there's a third one um so i'll be doing 17 soon but there's if there's any other groups i should check out um let me know and i'll get to it but yeah let's get right in to this one first off we have is the group photo all the members i love a aerial looking down shot so this is up my alley i love the placement of everybody I love that we have several members laying on top of each other. We have the all black. We have the leather. Um, some of the members really stick out because their hair. We have two, one, two, three blonde members, a redhead. Honestly, this would be real cool. Really cool if they all had different hair colors. Can you imagine like a blue and a pink and a teal and a purple? Especially against all this black, it would have really popped out. Uh, but yeah, I do like this photo a lot, though. I wish I could shoot something like this. If I shot an idol group, I would probably take notes from this and kind of do something similar because I love a shot like this. And I don't think I've ever done a shot like this before in my life. So this is very inspiring. All right, first solo shot. Again, I don't know the members like that. So like, I probably won't say names, but if you guys know who it is, let me know below. Um, this photo right here, absolutely stunning. I, first of all, I love how this hair styled. It's kind of like a beachy, wavy kind of vibe, but like kind of like just woke up tease. Um, whoever this is has the jawline for the gods, and I love that pronounced nose. It's so strong. Um, I think he might have been one of my favorites in the last photo set as well. I just think this look on him, his smiles, the makeup, it's just, it does so much for me. I just, I love it. I love it. I think it's so good. Next, we have, ooh. Okay, first of all, I am obsessed with his hair. I love the color, first off. Off rip, burgundy, lit. However, how it's styled with the parts, it's giving me very much Final Fantasy, and I'm here for it. Or it's giving me, um, what's his name? Uh, Axel from Kingdom Hearts, because the red color. Um, but the styling, it just makes it even cooler beyond just the color. I love it. But then we got his makeup. This, like, sickly, smoky eye that the idols do from time to time, I'm always living for, especially because I'm not the biggest fan of when they wear these contacts, but sometimes when they have a subtle contact, like subtle, you know, like a blue or like a brown, and they do this eye color, uh, eye makeup color, for some reason, the combo always hits for me. Like, I, I would rather they do a contact with a smoky brown eye situation rather than a contact and then have, like, a clean face, like very minimal eye makeup because it, it looks so jarring but here it looks very vampiric very vampiric the cubist bow on the lips these shadows hitting the side of the face oh guys i'm going to be shooting a lot this summer hopefully and i'm about to show out i'm about to show out i got some equipment some new equipment and i'm about to like really out here trying different lighting techniques and everything i'm really excited i'm like i am you have no idea i'm so hyped. but this is making me even more excited to do new things next image okay so i'm a big fan of reflection photos off rip based on that i like this photo now i do think the lighting on here is a bit um distracting a bit because it's not i like the shadows but i feel like maybe he, he if he would have um, tilted his head upwards, it wouldn't look so muddy. I know they go for like a sickly, sinister vibe, I guess, but <clears throat> this looks almost zombie-like. And I'm not, um, I need y'all to give me vampire, not zombie. And no shade to the zombie community, no shade. But I just feel like the vampire girlies really can give like a more of a 
you know. And I wish they would have did did the direction better with him. What y'all think? Next image. You know what? This is basic. It is simple. But I love it. I love the makeup. It's so clean. That Cupid's bow is in the lips. Like, that's like, I love Cupid's bow. And when they have, like, the prominent ones that are kind of deep like this, I'm like, oh, that's a serve. The jacket, the chain. I kind of like the, neg neg the negative space at the top of his head as well. Um, seems like something I would do, actually. I like that. Next. Wait, this is Kevin? No. What's the other one? Q? Kevin and Q. No, let me not. Let me not. I'm, I'm probably wrong. There's two members that look similar to each other. I think it's Kevin and Q. And this might be Q. I'm not going to say anymore because I'm probably wrong. But um, this one is fine. I'm not too crazy about... I'm not too crazy about the composition. Like, I think if he was a bit more in frame, I might like it a bit more. And maybe his head turned up a, just a smidge towards us a, a bit more. Because I do like the shadows. I love the purple lighting coming from the side. I just, I don't know if him having just a little bit of his body in the frame like this, in this way, is doing it for me. I feel like he's about to fall off the edge of the table. And I don't like that. So I need, I need, I need, it's a composition issue. I just need to push over a bit more and then turn his head up some. And then boom, that would, it would have been lit. It would have been lit. Next image. Okay, so, uh, hmm. I don't know if it's the retouch. Let me see. I think it's the retouching. It's looking a little zombie-like as well. And these shadows, like, it's like, ah. Uh, I'm not a fan of this. I should be, though. It has an element that I like. I just, I don't know if I like these shadows, how it's looking, and then, and like, the retouching looks a bit plasticky or too, it's weird over here. I'm not sure. Mm, I like the posing. I like the composition. I just don't like how the, <clears throat> the lighting looks here. It just looks a little suspicious. Mm, next image. Um, Wait, is this cute? No, it's not cute. It's not Kevin either. So I must have been you know what? I'm stop. Um, I like this. This one is also kind of you can tell the retouching's there, but it's lit nicely. The other one was I didn't like the lighting, but this one I like the lighting. Yeah, I like the lighting. I like the pose. Um, the shadows look nice. I think because the lighting is a bit better in this one, even though I can tell like they really went in on their retouching, it doesn't look too. Well, this one, I'm not going to lie. It does look like it's AI generated. Now I'm looking at it, really. Especially because the, the retouching isn't all the way the same on these hands. So compared to the face. It still looks good, though. I like it. It just looks a little... <laughs> and it looks a little retouched. Next image. Ooh, I like this one. I know, yeah, rather simple, but I like the posing. That jawline is going for miles. It is going for miles it is long as hell y'all i like this who is this who is this because they're giving they're giving the, with the hair the eyebrows the the lips the lips are like a plum color you better work i'm not sure if that's like a tint or something but that's a nice color on him next image i you know what another simple image that i'm just kind of living for and, and, and like it's that nose. It's so prominent and long. I love it. Let me zoom in. Who is this? And I like the hair, how it's styled with little, little layers of, uh, is that feathering? Or te not tethering. I think it's called feathering. Like, you have, like, layers that are wispy. I like that. Yes, it is very basic. It's not, it's not giving me drama or not giving me vampires. It's not giving me, you know, it's kind of giving me school picture, but I don't mind. I don't mind. He got the, he has a uniform on. He got the black uniform, and it's giving the same lighting, so, like, it, even though he's not giving the same murder vibes as the other members, but like it's it still works. He's a nice one. Next image. Ooh, come on, hair. Oh, I love. Okay, I love this angle because I love the cheekbones and how he's like kind of smizing like for his life. I love that. But like, I like how the hair is falling on his face on that side cheekbone. Um, and then the, and you, you the brows look amazing. And then like, I'm kind of curious if he just has a bunch of hairspray because the other side of his hair isn't because he's laying backwards. So you think his hair will move back, but if, it, if there's hairspray, it's not gonna move that much. Um, so it's kind of like a sculpted almost. You guys see that? I live for this. Let me zoom in. Let me zoom, zoom, zoom. Let my heart go. Boom, boom. Okay, these brows—they're thicker 
than a snicker. Who is this? This is a serve. All right, guys. Last image. Um. Okay. I like this. I'm not over the moon over it, but it it it's a good image. I like it. The brows. The, I like I like the mouth being open. Um. I like it. Very simple and effective. All right, guys, we made it to the end. So that means we can pick our favorite image. I'm going to go ahead and say it's going to be Redhead here. Literally obsessed with this. So obsessed with this. So good. Tens across the board for the boys. Who's his name? What's, who's his name? What's his name? And who is this? <laughs> Let me know below. Um, thank you so much for watching, y'all. I'm very excited to see what you guys think of these photos. Which one's your favorite? I can't wait to read the information. Tell me who I got names wrong, who I butchered. Um, let me know below. Um, like I said before, I want to do 17 soon. So be on the lookout for that. And yeah, I will see you guys in the next one.